What's up everyone? You got Danita with BootyBounce.com and excited to take you through an awesome water aerobics video. This is such a great one because I'm gonna bring all of the most top rated exercise that you can do in water. And I got this from my own mom that's been doing water aerobics for decades. For hips, joints, it's healing, it's anti-gravity. And so if you're needing resistance with just water instead, this is such a great one for you. So you can actually use the foam weights that come with water aerobics or you can actually just flatten your hand like this and that provides a resistance in the water too. So your choice on that. So let's go ahead and do it. All right, so first you wanna be able to make sure that the water is about shoulder height or anything that's kind of covering the dumbbells so when you're in the water, you're able to kind of feel that resistance with the water. So the first one, we're gonna go into hip closing and opening. So we're gonna go ahead and start with our hands out and with our leg out in the opposite direction. And we're just gonna swoop across with the water at the same time we bring that, that leg back and in. And we're just gonna feel this through the hips. You're gonna feel that through the inner thighs. And you're also gonna be toning the arms and the chest and the back through this one. So it's just a great one. You're gonna go ahead and do this in the waters. You're bringing that leg and really swooping it across. Now notice, as a beginner, I'm using that bent knee at first and then eventually we'll straighten that leg out and it's gonna feel super good on that inner thigh. And then when we're done there, we're gonna go ahead and do the other side. And you're really twisting through that core so you're getting that nice, good, small waist as well. Keeping those hands nice and flat so that it can be the resistance in the water that you need. And then when you're ready, straighten out that leg. Doing this in air, so you'll kind of feel the resistance in the water when you're doing this. And the goal is try to get from one side to the other side of your pool and try to do that about five times. Next one is gonna be the soldier walk. Now at first we're gonna just have a bent knee to get started. So bending that knee as that upper body is pushing down, really working that core, the chest, the whole entire body. And we're starting to get the heart rate up as well. That hand pushing in the water, creating that resistance. Now to make this one a little bit more challenging, we're gonna straighten those arms and that leg. So both arms are coming up as the one leg comes through the arms and you're just really pushing against that water, really feeling that as being more of an advanced move and it feels so good. Remembering to go about five times through different sides of the pool. Okay, next one we're gonna go into the reverse soldier. So hands are down and we're going to push up while our leg comes back behind. So it's just the reverse of what we were doing. Just taking that walk, straight leg. You're gonna feel this through the hamstrings and the glutes, the upper body, the back, and definitely you're working the core. Good work. Okay, next one is going to be our hug with step back. So you're going to hug and then step back. Bring it out, hug and step back. So you're just switching and alternating legs as you're going into a chest press here. Your arms are essentially going out like this, bringing it down, out like this, and you're doing it all in the water. Meanwhile, that leg is just kicking back. And it feels so good. We got the pendulum swing. Oh my gosh, this is such a great one. Okay, so hands come over to the opposite side of your body while your legs come out to the other. And when your legs switch, you're gonna switch those arms. So your legs are, are just straight, going back and forth. And your arms, what really creates the resistance here is keep your arms straight and push through the water. This one is such an intense one. I literally love that one. The next one is the rocking horse. So as your knees come up, the other leg's gonna come back. So 
You're just essentially rocking it back and forth like this. One leg straight, the other leg's bent. And you can see that you're just really working that core, your entire body, as you go through the rocking horse. And then you'll switch legs. So then this one comes up and that one goes back. Oh, it's so great in the water. You guys are gonna love this, I'm so excited. So this one is gonna be the high knee punch. So you're just gonna alternate arms with that leg. So the knee comes up and you're gonna punch through the water. And because we wanna get that cardio up, we can go into a little bit more advanced where you're going a little faster into the water. So you're really pushing the resistance of the water right here, working the core, the lower legs, and the upper body. Kicking it into high gear. Good, next one, same thing. This time you're gonna kick the butt as your arms are doing the same thing. So running, kicking the butt. Ba, 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 ba. Getting that heart rate up. Good, and then another cardio sprint is gonna be the puppet. So you're gonna have your dumbbells down here and you're gonna pull it up through the water while that other leg comes up. Out and down, up and down. And this will be your modification just as a beginner. And if you're a little more advanced, <laughs> like this, <laughs> oh yeah. Now this is a great one if you're in the deep, deep end. What it is is imagine yourself doing a jump rope over your dumbbells or your flat hands. Both knees are coming up as you swoop through and then as you come back, knees come back down, right? So up and down. Imagine both of my knees coming up so that way we're in the deep end and you're just bending those knees and you're just basically doing a jump rope through your legs. So imagine that and that's a really great one. The other one that you can do is imagine you're in the deep end and you're like this on your side and you bring the weights down as you bring the legs over to the other side. So bring it down in the water and legs are coming back and forth. You're here. Cool. And add any other varieties. Water aerobics should be a lot of fun, should be a lot of enjoyment. While your kids are playing in the pool or whatever, you can teach these workouts with them and they'll enjoy doing it with you. Getting that heart rate up, like I'm literally out of breath. Can you imagine if I had resistance in the water at this point? Oh, it feels so good. Awesome, well you guys kick butt. Super excited to see what you guys think of this workout. Again, the most top favorites. And if you wanna see more videos like this, you can go ahead and click the link down below, Booty Bands and Barbells app, and check it out. There's a lot more videos just like this.